At this point, this is uh, still under investigation by the FBI and other members of the intelligence community uh, to determine any ties or affiliations that these two individuals uh, may have had with ISIL or other terrorist organizations uh, around the world. What we do know is we know that there are extremists around the globe, around the globe, including some who are affiliated with ISIL, who are trying to capitalize on the opportunity that's presented by social media to try to communicate with individuals around the world, including inside the United States. Uh, there have been a, a large number of, not a large number, but there have been a, a number of individuals, Americans, who have been apprehended by law enforcement, who are attempting to travel to uh, the Middle East uh, to. Um, that, that at least is an indication of their level of sympathy for ISIL or for extremist organizations around the world. Uh, Bay has to consult with the Treasury Department when making these kinds of decisions. Uh, and there is no expression, however offensive, that justifies an act of terrorism uh, or even an act of violence. And uh, that uh, apparently uh, is what these two individuals in Texas were. Uh, trying to do. They were responding to one form of expression uh, that they found uh, offensive uh, and tried to use that as justification to carry out an act of terror.